Hi, I'm Aparna Ganesh and you're welcome to Joy Geeks, a channel where I create beauty and wellness videos. Very happy to be exploring beauty inside out. This is the first of my lip swatch for 2019. I'm featuring Maybelline Superstay Matting Liquid Lipsticks. The shades are exciting. The formula is promising. They had 20 beautiful shades earlier and they've added 13 new shades and I am thrilled to bring all those 33 shades in one video. This one. Happy, happy new year, folks. I hope everybody has fabulous plans for 2019. I surely do. And along with all my other Joy Geeks, I think it's going to be a blast of a year this year. Well, I had tons of videos planned for, you know, the year end. But, you know, uh, life took over, kids took over and, uh, you know, I couldn't post all the videos and have all the giveaways that I intended to. So in this video, I am having a giveaway. Two girls are going to win two lipsticks each and they're going to win a highlighter each in molten gold. The rules are really simple. Please hang on till the end of the video to know what they are. Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink Liquid Lipstick has launched 13 new shades and this is one of them. I am in love with a lot of the shades in the new collection as well as some from the old. I'm going to feature all of them, all 33 for you in one video. If you like these kind of videos, please do subscribe to the channel so that you get notified for all future posts. If you do, hit on the bell icon. I have to be honest, I did not like this lipstick at the first instance and I kind of shied away from it because as soon as I swatched it on my arm, it seemed very gooey and very gunky and I was like, oh, I don't want that on my lips. But uh, for some reason, when I you know looked at some more reviews and I was like, maybe I should give this a try, I finally cracked how one should use it to be able to use it to its optimum. This is just about letting it dry for a good 10-15 minutes like I have. Uh, and now you see, it is a bit tacky but nothing that really bothers me. I can... I'm fine, it doesn't come off, nothing. It doesn't even come off on the food that I eat. I think it's quite a winner. This lipstick definitely requires a lot of patience and time to dry down so if you are in a rush and you know you're going to apply the lipstick and start talking immediately this is not the correct lipstick for that time when you apply this just keep your mouth open for a few seconds and uh, don't let your uh, mouth press into each other because if you do that it's surely going to get very patchy and messy and uh, maybe use a hair dryer if you wanted to uh, dry out quicker but uh, it really helps because then you're set for the rest of the day. Just wait for it to set, girls. Please. Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink Lipsticks come in colored plastic square cubes, if I may call them. Uh, and uh, they are coordinated with the shade that they hold within them. And they're pretty accurate. It's not way off so far. Well, it has a beautiful arrow applicator, which has a little gap in the center, which, you know, uh, catches on to more product so that in just one go you can you know cover all of your lips first you use it in the center of your lip and then move on to the uh, corners of your lip and the arrow applicator is so precise that it will really allow you to create that you know perfect line to your lips of course you don't need a lip liner it's unbelievable how they've managed to price it at just rupees 650 and plus when I go to a place like Beauty Palace I always have about 12% or 10% discount so ah, it's lovely when you hear the word ink you may think that it's going to be a very thin consistency but it's not actually it's super creamy and almost gooey actually the pigmentation is quite intense it's one swipe application actually and uh, it's just about having patience to let it dry and then watch the magic all through the day. If you're a mum who has no time to touch up your lipstick or somebody at work who doesn't like to, uh, you know, keep uh, touching up or being bothered with your lipstick or anybody, even a college girl actually, this is the lipstick for you because once you've got it on, boss, it's just going to stay. These are available in super saturated shades. They're heavily pigmented and they do not dry down to a complete matte. They do have a slight satin finish to it, but nothing that I'm complaining about because overall it does give you a matte feel without drying out your lips and it stays for a long time. It lasts through meals, 
I had a whole uh, you know roll which was um, a little oily as well and it still didn't budge it did not you know like come off the inner part of the lip and stuff the flip side of this lipstick uh, is that it is not paraben free it is not cruelty free this is not a lipstick that you should be trying out when you're in a rush or if you need to change lipsticks in the day too many times this is not the lipstick because once it sets it's a tough thing to get out you have to use a good makeup remover i use the garnier micellar water without which it's impossible to take it off the color range is excellent there are some beautiful reds there are some beautiful nudes the fair skin girls the medium skin girls and the really dusky girls will all definitely find some shade in this huge shade range they weren't joking when they decided all sorts of shades they have a great too <laughs> all details of the shades that i have used in the order of appearance where you can get it from the price everything will be linked below i have divided the swatch into pinks and reds and bold colors and the nudes and browns so uh, if you'd like to straight jump to a specific color the time stamps will also be in the description box that's just clickable and you can straight go on to that one. i will probably mark uh, the new shade uh, names and numbers in the description box below and I will mark my favorite shades with a heart on the screen with the name just like you guys asked for I am shooting this in natural light and I hope you like it I'm quite happy with how beautiful this looks uh, orange is a tough color to crack, but this seems to be doing quite a decent job. I really like this shade because it's a bright red, something that we all look forward to. And uh, if it's long stay like this is, why not? La casa del merengue. You will notice that the reds keep getting better as I go on. This is slightly deeper than what you saw earlier. So you have all the possible shades that you can pick from. I like so many of the new shades. It's a very rusty uh, brown tinted red which I absolutely love. I think this shade is quite a disaster not just because it's too light for my skin tone but um, it's very patchy I don't think even very light skin girls will be able to really make use of The shade cooler. Such a pretty pink. Oh my god, I love this. I wore it so often in my Amritsar trip and it did not fail me. It's such a beautiful 
you know, pinkish, plumish, you know, a very different shade that uh, that I really love. quite a disaster for my skin tone clearly but maybe really really pale girls this would really work for you all these nudes like i said clearly not for brown girls but i'm sure there will be fairer skin girls who would love this i just love the shade This is one of those very uh, few peachy nudes that has good pigment and that really feels good on the lips. Some of the colors of the cap is not as coordinated. This looks pretty light in the tube. but it's a beautiful rust terracotta orange on my lips i just love the shade i'm so happy this is one of the shades that i am giving away delicate is also a new shade it's such a pretty pink a new shade again very beautiful i can see tons of shades that resembles kathleen lights uh, miami fever and that makes me happy because it means the shades are will be closer home and uh, i don't have to uh, go to ofra Thakur I have to say every time I open my mouth wide and smile for the swatches and you come into my mind I immediately shut it well I'm trying I hope you're okay with it for those who don't know Mrs Thakur is a subscriber who had uh, requested me so sweetly that please don't just smile so broad because more than the lipstick your teeth is being shown <laughs> so uh, I try to not uh, you know have that kind of a broad smile Although that's what comes naturally to me. If anybody was looking for a really dark chocolate shade, this is it and it is not patchy surprisingly. I haven't seen too many of these colors which you know are as smooth and as pigmented as this is. So well done Maybelline. I am very impressed especially after this shade. Puerto Rico
is one of the new shades and I love this lovely maroon which is not too dark not too subtle I like it to see how the lip color changes the look of your teeth now look how yellow this makes my uh, teeth look this shade may not be most wearable for me on an everyday basis but i think if you're doing some editorial stuff or you know some high fashion shoot this would look so funky and also what i am right now thrilled about is that even this shade is not patchy it has glided on effortlessly and uh, it's quite pigmented This is quite an interesting shade. It's one lilacish, purplish, greyish uh, lipstick. Ooh! <laughs> How exciting is this shade? Something really unique, and I don't have this in my collection. This somehow reminds me of Holy, doesn't it? For everybody who tried this and said that it was too sticky for them. I urge you try this again. There is an exciting giveaway. It's very simple. Two girls are going to win two lipsticks each and they're going to win a highlighter. Each. Everybody loves these highlighters, so I kind of included these uh, in the giveaway. What I'd like you to do is there are four shades that's 230 Transformer, 115 Founder, 130 Self Starter and 220 Ambitious. I would like you to pick the two shades that you would like and just comment below. Uh this comes any way with the winner but uh I'd like to know which shades you'd want. I'd love to see which shades you guys are gunning for and which is like the most favorite uh favorite of them all. I've kept four different shades, red, a nude, a plum, a uh, 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 you know, beautiful pink which is my favorite founder. So let me know which one is yours. You can have four separate entries as four separate comments with you know the combination that you'd like to have and that would really help me and you uh, have a larger chance actually of winning. So I'm very excited to give these away because they are lovely shades and uh, two are from the new collection and two are from the old if I'm not mistaken. You do need to be subscribed to my channel Joy Geeks on YouTube and if you're also subscribed to Joy Geeks on Instagram and if you're following me there you do have an edge you do have a brownie point there the rules and details will also be given in the description box below let's have fun ladies do let me know which are your favorite shades and which other videos that you'd like me to make i'm most delighted to receive your feedback i'm pretty happy with just lipstick makeup and i do not use a foundation and you know on a full face of makeup on an everyday basis so i'm happy that all you guys are also enjoying my lip swatch videos and uh, cheers to a lot more in 2019 that's all for now See you.